Welcome back, Pokemon fans. My name is Angel of the Night 091, and today we're going to continue on with our Pokemon uh, Ultra Sun Let's Play. I just realized that uh, I didn't show you guys the intro yet. Alright, so we got the uh, Necrozma flying here, of course, through the uh, hyperspace. Or through the Ultra Wormhole, rather. Wow, I'm not awake yet. I apologize, guys. I had an amazing snooze. Oh my gosh, I was up all night last night, and uh, of course, we just recorded about an hour and a half's worth of uh, episodes. So we just got three episodes pre recorded. Um, wow, what an amazing intro. Oh, man, look at that guy coming in. Oh, get out of there, Lunala. No! Oh, man. He is captured. Beautiful, beautiful intro. And it's just going to sit there and it's just going to go through and loop. While this is an amazing login screen there as well. It's actually pretty sweet. Holy cow. All right, let's get into our uh, our Let's Play here. So the last uh, part of our Let's Play, we actually went through the trainer school and uh, we defeated four trainers and the teacher, and now we are off to Heoli City. So let's get ourselves going here. Gonna get back into the groove here. All right, look at that moon. What a moon it is. Man, she's still going to the water, all right. Beach time! Yeah! Hey you! You've come to Alola from someplace far off, haven't you? I can tell. <clears throat> then let me teach you the proper way to greet someone in Alola. Alola. You give it a try too. Just like that. Alola. You'll make more friends if you say it. Alright, let's keep going here. Ooh, who's this? They're new. Alola. You here on vacation, young friend? Or are you perhaps a trial goer? I'm a trial goer. Well, you are most welcome to Alola either way. In fact, why don't you take this? Hey, hey, we got a potion. And Joey, how, <laughs> how Oli, enjoy Alola, and most of all, enjoy Pokemon. All right, all right, crazy old lady. All right. Oh man, don't teach me how to use the Rotom Dex, please. Hey, Elena, I thought I recognized the sound of those feet. So what do you think? Heoli is something, eh? Alola's gotta be the best place ever to live. Oh yeah. Hey Elena, come in here with me. I've got a good idea of something you could do. <clears throat> hey miss, is it true that you can get some kind of special gift if you have a Rotom Dex? My goodness. You get the news fast. Hardly anyone has a Rotom Dex, but it is true that we have a special item to go with it. It's our very own Pokefinder. Here you go. Pokefinder. Ooh, boy. So, like, what's a Pokefinder? Oh. The Pokefinder is a tool that lets you take photos of Pokemon. Rotom will help point out places where you'll be able to take photos too. 
Here, I'll read you the instruction manual. Please don't. Tap on Rotom or press R. Yep, that's all it says. Quite simple, isn't it? Man, that Rotom Dex is cool. It's like a whole nother partner, Elena. I mean, on top of your Poke uh, Pokemon partner. Oh, but I guess since it's Rotom inside, it pretty much is a Pokemon partner. Either way, you're pretty darn lucky. Meet you outside when you're done in here. <laughs> the photos you can snap of Pokemon with a Pokefinder. They are simply too cute to resist. Alright, no need to look around in here. Alright, let's keep going. Elena, how? Did you just visit the tourist bureau? How was it? We got our Rotom decks upgraded. Now it takes pictures too. What a wonderful helpful uh, helper you are, Rotom. <laughs> Random pictures. I wish they didn't make Lily so like skit skitty, you know. I, I don't know if that's the right word for it. She seems really like spooked easily. Or kind of wimpy still. Ah ha ha ha! What was that for, Rotom? Go and put that little trickster back in your bag, Elena, and follow me. Enough feasting for the eyes. It's time we take care of our stomachs. Man, he runs off quick. Maybe Rotom wanted to get your attention because it wants to take photos with you. I think I'll go stop by the apparel shop to do some shopping of my own. Uh, can I, can I go? I wanna go. Yo, trainer, look what you've got. You lucky kid. If you've got a poker finder, then I guess I'll give you a little tip. See that spot where the wall is cracked? That's a photo spot right there. Look at that. Your Rotom there is trying to tell you too. Give him a tap. I don't want to tap Rotom. Oh man. Alright. Firing up the Poker Finder. We're gonna see Pikachu. Oh, it's Pikachu. Use the circle pad to move a camera around. Got it, kiddo? Then press the camera button to take a photo. But you gotta be quick. Good shots don't wait. You can take up to six shots each time you fire the Poker Finder. Come on. Move Pikachu. Snap. 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 And... Snap. I think the last one is the one I want to show off. There we go. Yeah, that's totally the best one. And yeah. Apparently got 1,103 thumbs up. Alright. Done with that. Not taking pictures. I hear it's best to try to photograph Pokemon head on and zoomed in as close as possible. If you want to know more about the Pokefinder, well, just keep on taking tons of pictures. Alright, let's go to the apparel shop. I want to see what we can get. Oh, Elena, tell me, do you pick out all your own clothes? Of course I do. Of course, most people do, don't they? I... I've always just worn the clothes that my mother wanted me to wear. I don't really know what kind of thing would suit me. Oh, but that's not why I stopped you. I meant to give you these, Elena. I received them inside the apparel shop here. I didn't even buy anything, but they said I was the 99th thousand, 999th customer to visit the store. But I already have the same set, so I thought that you might want them. Alright, I've got the lens case. 
We got the makeup bag. It looks like we have something in common now, don't we, Elena? He. Okay, let's go to the apparel shop, because why not? Let's see what they got. Let's see what they got. Hopefully, some, hopefully this stuff's different. I don't know why I get super excited there, but customizing a trainer is um, is pretty amazing. Uh, <laughs> what is this? Uh, okay. All right, so the standard V-neck. Oh man, this is disappointing. Those t-shirts at the beginning though were very basic. Ah, the surf tank top. Ah, uh, I can't do that. I can't do that. Um. All right, I'm gonna get the black pleated ones because orange and black go together. I'm okay with the orange top. Stockings, that's fine. Oh, uh, we can't we can't just go right for the triply hat. We're gonna keep the same hat. Alright. We're gonna keep the same hat. We're just gonna change the uh change the pants to black. There we go. Customize the trainer just slightly. Uh you know what? I'm okay with the haircut thing. I'm okay. Trainer's trainer's cool enough as it is. What's this? Shopping mall. Oh, it's closed. Sad. Oh, a sticker. Greetings, Captain Lima here. So you've spotted me sticking up one of these lovely stickers, have you? That's a sticker? Oh, yes. If young trial goers collect these stickers as they travel and follow the path they indicate, they will quite naturally progress along their island challenge. Really, if I had to describe them, I would say these stickers really save trial goers like you. Well, that's kind of weird. But I cannot let my guard down. Those Team Skull thugs have far too much time on their hands and they're always trying to get in the way of trainers on the island challenge. I have to keep an eye on them to be sure they don't take down my stickers. I've always just had to report that Team Skull was seen making trouble around town. I suppose I should have a go have a, go have a look. Well then, young Elena, I hope you'll have a delightful time running around search out the Clex totem stickers. All right. You gently peeled off the totem sticker. You've got it. You've collected one totem sticker. All right, let's heal up. All right, so we do have Pokeballs already, that's fine. We need to um, see if we can catch some Pokemon in this area. I think there's some Pokemon in the area we can catch. Oh, what's this guy? A journey is made by those who travel with you, and compassion makes the world go round. Let me share this with you, young trial goer. Hey, we've got a heal ball. Pokemon you catch in a heal ball will have their HP restored to the maximum level. They also. Oh, sorry, they are also cured of any status conditions they might have. Cool! Alright. Let's see if we can maybe find an Abra. I bet, I think Abra was here the last time. There we go. Wild Abra appeared! I've never seen this Pokemon. And it's level nine. Oh man, I'm gonna try a great ball. 
Alright, down and B, guys. Down and B. Let's get the Sabra. Alright, we got Abra. We are putting this in our party. Because Abra is pretty cool. Grubbin needs to needs to leave. I don't need two electric Pokemon in my team. I'm gonna go with the Pikachu. Or the Pichu rather. Oh! Furfro! Oh man. I really like Furfro. Oh, I'm super pumped. Oh, I can't use that. Right, that's a ghost type move. Sheet. Oh man, super pumped up that there's a fur fro. I wonder where I can go get his haircut. See if we can catch him with a premier ball. One, two, three. Oh yeah, here we are. Oh man, it's a bump. Oh, level 14. Is this gonna be the point where my litany evolves? Wants to learn Fire Fang? Get an old move. Yeah, let's take a leer. <clears throat> Pichu level 9. Zerua level 11. Picky Peck level 9. Hey, Rock Smash, there we go. And for first data, we'll be adding to the Pokedex. Oh man. I love Furfro. All right, left alone, its fur will grow longer and longer, but it will only allow someone it trusts to cut it. Yeah, that sounds like me with my beard. Uh, would you like to give Furfro a nickname? No. And yes, let's add him to our party. Who do I want to put in my party? Oh man, I have I have Beniri though. So many cool Pokemon. Uh, I can't put him on. Uh, maybe I should switch Abra for Furfro. Oh, Pokeball. Hey, we got a revive. That's cool. Actually, I wonder if we can get our Furfro's haircut in one of those salons. That'd be kind of cool. Oh man, what? My Junior. No way! Oh, oh man! What is this? Oh man! I cannot believe we just found Mime Jr. Okay, we're gonna put him in a heal ball. You know what? I kind of think I want to take Mime Jr. over Abra. Just because of just because of the Pokemon. 
just because it's different. I usually always go for Abra, don't I? Oh, we just wasted our heal ball. You bugger. Alright, we're gonna just try over the Pokeball. Oh man. My freaking junior. Alright, there we go. I wonder what else is here. So far there's Abra, there's Furpro, there's Vine Jr. Yeah. Oh man, Abra. Yeah, I really need to I'm gonna swap I'm gonna swap for Mime Jr. I'm totally gonna swap for Mime Jr. Such a cute Pokemon. Uh, no nickname, but yes, we are going to put him in the party. Because that'll give me a fairy Pokemon, too. Yeah, goodbye. Goodbye, Abra. Bye-bye. Alright, let's see what else is here. And some Meowth. I think I already have Meowth. So there's a Meowth. And Rhymer. cool with it. Let's get some more Pokeballs, and then we'll keep going on the, uh, the route here. Is that a sticker? That is a sticker. Alright, there we go. That is the second sticker, guys. Ooh. Let's go up here. Oh, no. That takes us back to where we just were, wasn't it? Yeah. How's it, Elena? If you're looking for good eats, you found them. Ah, the Malasada is out. Shop. Blah, 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 blah. Alright, tongue tied. Plus, Milasadas make your Pokemon like you. And affectionate Pokemon are better in battle. Who could resist giving their Pokemon a few Milasadas, eh? They're just so cute. Yo, 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 check it. Whenever we're. <laughs> Whenever, wherever, we meet you, Team Skull don't even greet you. I mean, you just said yo, yo, yo. <laughs> Yo, you want to throw us a bone and hand over those island challenge amulets to us now? Oh, so you're part of the Team Skull, huh? All you guys ever do is steal totem stickers and people's Pokemon and get in the way of other people's island challenges. You know it. We hate the island challenge, yo. And every kid fool enough to try it. <laughs> Yo, let's check these fools. Elena, come on. Let's teach these Team Skull jerks not to get in the way of anybody's island challenge. Yo, check how I changed my game in my mad Pokemon skills. You are challenged by Team Skull Run.
Oh, Litten, don't get confused. There we go. For real? Over already? No fair. I was playing a different game. Let's get out, up out this port, B. Nobody has to know about this. We don't need your whack little amulets anyway. Wow. Would it even take them if you gave them to us? Those Team Skull Jerks really have too much time on their hands, yeah? But keeping other people from doing their island challenges isn't gonna just make it like they managed to finish theirs, you know? I already went down to the marina and screamed out over the ocean, watch out world, someday I'm gonna be beat even my old gramps in an all out serious battle. So maybe I'll go try to find some more totem stickers next. See you around. What a lovely battle you showed us there against Team Skull. My thanks to you and your Pokemon. Why don't you heal your team to express my gratitude? Or why don't I heal my... Oh, well, okay. So he's going to heal my team. I must admit, I've been wondering about you since I saw you at the trainer school. Professor Kukui brought you along, and you and your Pokemon seem to defeat our teacher so effortlessly. Very well, then. Allow me to see if you're ready for my trial. Behold the magnificent Pokemon of the one and only Captain Lima. She's got one more poke. I bet it's Smearable. Oh, I should have switched. Ooh, it has water again. Oh, I was so not expecting that. I'm Junior. Yes, you have emerged victorious. You, or should I say your Pokemon, you and your Pokemon make quite an interesting team. I do hope you'll come to Burden Cavern and attempt the trial, the trial of Lima. You can get there from Route 2, 
That road to home decks of yours should show you the should be able to show you the way. I bid you a Lola. Wow, you're not even gonna heal my Pokemon? Man, I gotta go all the way back to the Pokemon Center. Okay. Poor Litten. Getting getting all messed up there. I guess I could have revived Linden, but I think I should probably save that revive for later on. <laughs> All right, the Malasada shop. Yeah, we're gonna give it to Pichu. Because we want to get his happiness up. Oh, his affection went up. Alright, we're going to give one to Mime Jr. Because I'm pretty sure Mime Jr. evolves by happiness too. Actually, now that I think about it, does Le Honey? Le Honey doesn't evolve by happiness, does it? I gotta. I, not, not Le Honey, um. Veneery. Just gonna double check. I don't think it does. It's been a while since I've seen a Veneery. Bet you it does. No way do I have three Pokemon with happiness. Leveled up with friendship. Ah, oh, damn. I got three Pokemon on my team that evolved by happiness. Ah, oh, this is gonna take forever. Try Veneri again. Oh, it doesn't look like it's hungry. Oh, we can't spam Malasadas. Damn it. Oh, is that a sticker? Oh, it's totally a sticker. Oh, that's new. What is this? Matchamp is holding a sign that says Alola Photo Club coming soon. Okay. Ah, there's another sticker. Okay, we really need to find these stickers. There's another Pokeball there too I'm gonna have to get. Alright, we got four stickers. Pokeballs there. We're gonna come back anyways. We're gonna go backwards and get another. Oh, there's a TM. How do I get in there? There we go. Echoed voice. Another sticker. Figured that's where another one would be. Yeah, another one 
there too. Tiny mushroom, okay. And let's heal up our pokes there just in case. I think we already are full health actually. Now that I think about it. Oh! Wait for me, Elena! Oh, I'm glad to see a familiar face. I always get lost so quickly. I can't figure out the roads here. I can't even buy my own clothes. But you, you're moving on to your first trial? You're going to Verdant Cavern? I read something in an old book once. It said that the island challenges were once a journey made to prove yourself and gain the strength to battle against the guardian deities of Alola, like Tapu Koko. The people in Iki Town said that Tapu Koko loves Pokemon battles, didn't they? If we could meet Tapu Koko once more, do you think we would find the answer to why it saved you and Nebby that day? Uh, probably so that we, we didn't go splat on those rocks. Oh yes, please take these. They're called revives. If you use one on a Pokemon that has fainted, it will recover and feel a little better. Sweet, we got three revives, that means four total. Good luck on your first trial. I hope that it goes well for you. Oh, there's Hala. There, Elena, I got this ornery creature calmed again, for now. Want to try to give him a little pat again? That's the only way he'll get used to you. Mm. <laughs> Let's poke its nose. Hmm, Taurus didn't seem to care for that. Moo. Maybe old Tauros here can't feel your love for Pokemon. He sure seems happy to know you, and yet it, se it still seems to me like Tauros wants to stretch his legs on his own island challenge. Ha! What? You want to play tag now? The Mella Mella Kahuna never loses, friend. <laughs> Alright, so he's just gonna run around after the Tauros. Okay. All right, group number two. Oh, careful out there, young trainer. Haven't you seen the way the grass shakes on Route two? The rustling grass hides Pokemon that is dying to pounce on some easy to turn your target, but battling those feisty creatures can be worth it. They sometimes drop items after battle. All right, all right, chill. Oh, I've lost him. Because of a rat attack. Lame. Oh, maybe I have, maybe I haven't. Maybe I'll still be able to get that one. Alright, catch your pokes on route number two. Alright, no need to no need to uh, read his dex entry. You guys all know where it's at. Alright, he's going to the PC. Oh, okay, cool. We didn't lose him. Alright, what's it gonna be? It sounds like Smeargle. 
Ekans. Yes, please. <laughs> Sweet. Level 10. That ain't bad. Paralysis out of here in a minute. Oh, he's already got bite, and I can't call back Litten. guys. Canary is level 10. What up? Oh wow, look at that sprite. That is cool. We very rarely ever see Ekans not coiled up. Alright. The eggs of bird Pokemon are its favorite food. It swallow swallows eggs whole, so sometimes an egg gets stuck and Ekans faints. Wow, okay. That's a little dark. Wow, Nintendo. Um, do I want Ekans? I mean, Ekans would be a really cool Pokemon to have on my team. Oh, it looks so cool, though. Damn it, Nintendo. Why do you have to do this to me? I mean, I feel I probably don't need two dark types on my team. But Zorula is so freaking cute. Ah, uh, he's gonna have to go to the part uh, to the PC. Oh, weird! Didn't drop anything. All right, let's heal up our Litten. Get that drowsy. Oh. Okay, so so far there was drowsy and there was ethics. Okay, so Furfro is also under this route. You don't need to battle Furfro. Alright, let's get this drowsy.
Alright, there we go. We got the drowsy. Wants to learn meditate. Yes, please. Um, let's take a copycat. So I don't think there's very many Pokemon here, maybe. Okay, so there's Abra, there's Furfro, Drowsy, Ekans... Abra, Furfro, Drowsy, Ekans, Meowth. That's five. We'll try one more. Smeargle, there we go. That's what we want. Alright, we're just gonna see if we can catch it this way. Sweet. Alright, we just got Smeargle. I know this wasn't supposed to be a catch em all, guys, but I'm really interested to see what Pokemon are around. Alright, level 15. What up? I guess Litany Balls at 16, doesn't it? So let's go into the PC. I'm pretty sure that's all there's going to be there. Welcome, trial goer. Think you can handle the ordeal of defeating a beauty? You are challenged by Beauty Crystal. Okay, we'll do that after. Actually, let's uh let's cure him of that paralysis. Also learn fury swipes. Yes, please. this one we gotta use, isn't it? I think so. Alright. Uh, let's see here now. Now, I think, I think if we're in here, we can use this to get his happiness up. So let's, uh, let's see here. He doesn't like that. <laughs> Alright. 
right, so... Mime Jr.'s affection is one heart. Okay, let's... Maybe feed him. Oh, he doesn't like that. This is not too, too bad. So we're going to do this with a couple of our Pokemon, get the affection up. Because I think this increases their, their friendship. I think it does. Pretty sure. Pretty sure if we do this to a couple of our pokes, we'll get their happiness up. Okay, so uh, Benary doesn't like being touched on the ears, which is kind of interesting. here guys sorry about that i just want to make sure that i try to get their affection up i didn't realize that when i put the pokemon on the party that it would be uh so many that evolved by friendship i think lapunny would be a pretty good pokemon to have trainers visit our cemetery where Pokemon rest to pay their respects. Oh, so pay your respects. Okay. Alright guys, this is where we are going to stop the episode there today. If you guys enjoyed the episode, go ahead and press that like button. And be sure to post your comments in the comment section below. Uh, today I'd like to know what do you guys think about all these friendship heavy Pokemon? Such as like, Veneery, Pichu, you know... Mime Jr. Should I have them all on my team? Or do you guys think that I should be swapping them out for something else? Such as like Furfro or Ghastly or something. Alright guys, uh, thank you very much for watching the video. And as always, hope you guys had a fantastic day there today. And I hope you all take care.